here we go. Apparently, I am giving away 90k in inducements to Resident Evil. Which is a pretty... Let's see, two... Two mummies, uh, one with guard. Wow. One white with guard. One gold with guard. But 11 players, so I guess, I don't know, maybe we can do something about that. That's, uh, that's scary and annoying. That's a lot of strength and a lot of guard, meaning even more strength. But not that much, um, not that much mobility. Hmm. Hmm, I'm dead. Yep. I like that. I'm gonna update the title. You should. I think. That's very nice of you. When it lets me. Come on now. I will. Wait. Hmm. Mm. I thought I could. Hmm. I'm pretty sure I can stream to your channel. Doesn't that mean I have to have no. the rights to... No, but oh, if okay. you have mod power to... Sh no, well, no, you need admin powers, I think. Yeah, I don't have admin Ooh, powers, so I'm gonna my pick. B can do it when he gets back. Get Make sure no one was making cheese puns while I wasn't paying attention. Where is my other loner? There he is. Okay, good. We're good. No, why would I make the child of Pete cheese pun? Those are banned. Actually, we're gonna switch these two guys around. Like so. And there we go. At some point I should get a twelfth player. I guess that's gonna, mm. that's gonna uh, happen when I start buying catchers. Mm. Also, you should have no no mercenaries at some point too. Oh, well, like it's not on elf teams. It's not super some for some of the elf team. The um, the mercenaries are so good that it's not the end of the world. The big problem with having mercenaries is that once they get, they take your SVP. Uh. You can hopefully stop that, but uh, mostly it's that they once they get knocked out, you don't have any spare players. Like. <laughs> do I have a cigarette? I do not. I don't smoke. Uh, at this point, I won't go. I, I. Okay, this so it's like probably his blodge player here. Uh, it's gonna be the bold carrier because it's the only one in the back And then he's really spread out because I guess he doesn't want me to run through and do things to the ball If he doesn't pick it up, so Oh, it's a Resident Evil quote apparently Well, okay, the zombie got it Yeah, <laughs> that makes sense. That's not half bad It, it um it could have been much worse in that it it could have it could have scattered out. Well, it could have been better in that it scattered somewhere over here. But if it scattered to me, that would have been um, not great. The good thing with the zombie having it is that the zombie doesn't have that high movement, so he can't really run that far. And these guys here are tied up with knocking down my LOS, so maybe the cage won't be super great. It will have a mummy in it though, which can be annoying. Eh, it's a badly hurt loner again. Hmm. I'm well, that's sorry, no fun. I didn't. I don't play Resident Evil games. I don't know about cigarettes or gum or whatever. That's a. Uh... Okay, that's good. Um, I thought he was. Well, he didn't. I thought he was going to go for my plus strength line man because he's a plus he's a strength 5 mummy.
Okay, um, hmm. The question is, are we going to attack this cage? The answer is yes, probably. Wasn't good. <laughs> Did it? Davidianal asks, uh, "My league match is about to start. I'm playing Undead versus Wood Elves. Any advice?" How much tackle do you have? I did it! I got a rune. You got a room? I got a rune. You got marooned? Rune? Yes. Oh. Uh, congrats, I guess? I've, so I've given up on Twitch chat. It's, it's doomed. I've just, <laughs> just gone to play Dungeon Crawl. Uh, Okay, so this is apparently going to be a slow roll. Roll. Hmm. It depends on how, what he does with this cage here. He might just move it forward one square, and if he does, um. I'm kind of okay with that. Okay, uh, yeah, he's gone too. Navetti doesn't have any tackle because they're fresh teams, but he does have an extra zombie, which he's going to use to step on uh, witch elves. Or not witch elves, war dancers. That's probably not worth it, to be honest, because you're going to have. Like, you need to invest so much time in knocking them down. That you should be, like, covering other dudes instead of putting 20 guys in the war dancer. Yeah. Um, just make sure to block with your whites every turn and uh, with your mummies you have like the strength advantage what you need to do is you need to make sure that your ghouls are pretty free to move because they're going to run away from you pretty quickly because they're much faster than you are That's not why. Well, the good news is that I can run in, hopefully. Okay, we're going to go for the bold carrier here because we are so much better at handling the bold than they are. Oh, he fucking has a guard. I'm an idiot. I should probably move out then anyway, shouldn't I? Oh, now we're kind of stuck here, so I guess we'll be stuck here for a bit then. I'm not, that's what I get for not paying attention. Uh, here we go. That... <laughs> <laughs> that was horrible. That was really bad. What? Oh, he snake eyed. Uh, that's. I need to move this line backward because now the ghoul has it and the ghoul can run this way. And if these guys are standing up here, they they're gonna get knocked down.
Hmm. Yeah. Oh, oh well. Hopefully he's not... Since he's caging, like, already, I don't think he's gonna try and outrun me. I think he's gonna make another cage somewhere over here, which means I can get... I can regroup. Uh, but it also means that he's gonna block my dudes a bit. And, I mean, I knocked the ball loose, it would've been nice if he went over here. But you can't get everything. Rudeski wants to know if the terrible plane has started. The what? The terrible plane. I don't know if he's referring to you, or... I don't know what that means. Plane badly. You know. Suboptimally? I always play suboptimally. And this is Blood Bowl, you can't play optimally. You can expect the worst at all times. No, I, you, you, no. well, playing op optimally in the case of Blood Bowl would be managing your dice rolls. Yeah. Not taking unnecessary risks. So I would argue that you, in fact, do play optimally. Because you try not to fuck up. Uh, I do try that at times. I'm not sure where he's going with this goal, to be honest, because there's no, like... He moved the the other ghoul over here, but he... Like, yeah, these guys are lying down, but he can't outrun them. You know. He is at least on the other side of the pitch for most of your players. Mm, that's true. I shouldn't have followed up there, but I did. Um... Okay, let's see here. That guy needs to stand up. This is not a loner, so we can move him. This guy's a loner, so he gets to just stand up. These guys aren't, so... Okay, um... Gonna move him over there. Um. Ooh, Dark White is a good name for a Batman team. Ah, uh, damn it! Fuck it. Ah, uh, misclicked. Oh well. That's my own damn fault. Phew. Okay, made it. Uh. And uh, now this guy is going to run the long way around, because I followed up here when I couldn't have. Yes. Unfortunately, that means I can't... Uh, I'm not going to do the last GFI, because I need to... Uh, this guy has to stand up, unfortunately. I'm, I'm, well, I'm all out of rerolls, so it doesn't actually matter. But I want to do this. If I can. <laughs> and I couldn't. <laughs> Uh, that's just a miss next. We don't apothecary that. Ah, uh, that's such a shame. I almost made it. Like, you should- I mean, I didn't- You always fail the last roll, but in this case it was actually, you know, well, I guess it was the second to last roll because after the GFI would have been the, uh, uh, would have been the, uh, blocks, but still. The reason I had the blitzer here was that if, even if I just pushed him back, I could have pushed him back into the Blitzer. Okay. But it seems like he's going to keep running here. Uh, which I don't mind, because most of his players, well, most of his players aren't fast enough to keep up. It would be nice though, to have some rerolls for when I, uh... How am I looking? Uh, 
I'm down to nine. That's not good. Oh, what? Where are you? Why? I'm... This? No. This makes no fucking sense. You do never. Okay, so you never position a cage next to someone who's standing up because that means I can get into this cage this way. And this thrower here? Also standing up. And there's no guard here. I would... What? That... That... I, do... I don't understand. Okay, um... Okay, so this is now a two die on this guy <laughs> with my egg thrower, but let's do it because this guy doesn't have block. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go down both of us. I should have, uh, I should have, uh, well, hindsight and all that. But it's still free. It's not in any tackle zones right now, uh, but it's going to have to... Uh, well, he might actually try and pick it up with the ghoul again. And he should be able to do it because he has... Well, no, he's not going to pick it up with the ghoul because the ghoul is actually in the tackle zone, so he'd have to dodge out. He's probably going to pick it up with the white, but the white can't get... Well, he can get over here with the GFI. If he wants to score now, which he may or may not want to do. But yeah, that's that's what happens when you put a cage next to someone who's standing up. Um, it's. Uh, if you do that, it's not a secure cage, because then you can block open a space rather than, um... <clears throat> ah, he did pick it up. Okay, let's see if he's gonna... What? What's up? Uh, uh... Hmm... I agree. With those guttural noises you made. Hmm. Oh, nice. This is my dodge. Yep. Guy. So. Gonna stand this loner up. Uh, protect the players that can actually, or, or rather stop the players that can actually pick the ball up. And now all we do is that. And then, yeah, we're going to do it the slightly safer way. Since we don't have any rerolls left. Give it to the Blitzer. And run away with that guy. So we have more players up here. Uh, and you also have the privilege of running away. Congrats. 
Hooray! Okay, so we stole the bowl again. Yay! Yay! We're the bowl havers now. They can I love having balls. Uh, they can still, um... It's not too hard for the undead to get two dice on the, uh, on the Blitzer, but at least the Blitzer has Blodge, uh, making him a bit harder to knock down. I don't think there's any tackle around. No. Thrower got knocked down again. Scuzzy Seven, we're one zero and two at this point. Um, but we've taken a whole lot of injuries. But only to linemen Most, that I don't care about. Yeah, mostly have been linemen. So perhaps Giant Pink Walrus, it is not my keyboard that is loud, but your volume that is high. Ooh, I see what you did there. Mm. Okay, no, no, you Turn, don't, don't, you don't blitz snap that. No, what that. Well, he, he, we did kill both of his gunners. That's Rigetsky. No, that's pretty crushing. Uh, no, he did it though. Oh wow! Look at all these people in the chat being like, "No, it's my keyboard." Fuck you guys. What the? Seriously, fuck that play. Nice. That was not. Well, I mean, it it was his drive, I guess. So, but still, that that's annoying because that could have been done much more efficiently, i.e., better. <laughs> And that didn't have to be a um, a one die blitz. That could have easily been a two die blitz. I could just hold the keyboard really far away from me. Hopefully, uh, I'll have a new mic at some point, guys. That'll that'll help. But mod Mike needs to get off their ass and actually finish their new. Thing. Okay, so we're down to nine, but we do have an excellent thrower now, so that's a good start. Where are my freaking loners? There's one, and I think the other one's actually injured, so. Hmm. I don't think this is even a mechanic. Well, it is mechanical, but it's like these are. Like plasticky keys, I think. Logitech wireless? I don't think it's springs. One, two, three, four, five. I think it's nipples. Six. Well, I don't have a stuffy nose anymore. Okay. Um, time to um, time to get that two turn pass play. Oh, sweet. We need a reroll. That's really good. Let's start by getting rid of this guy. If we can. Uh, that's good enough. Hooray, I'm agile. And you can't reach that wall, so I can do some other stuff first. Uh, And now 
we pick the ball up? Oh, and we did pick the ball up. Well, it wasn't that nice. Okay. Uh, that was a very uh, good um, turn six in that we got two people into scoring position. If you really want to make it weird, uh, we have three people in scoring position. Okay, that's good. Uh, well, I mean, it's bad, but one of them was going to get knocked down. Uh, it's nice that the mummy uh, went over here. That means this guy's going to get probably put between these two ghouls. think probably we'll see probably maybe like they're not gonna leave him alone um, and they need to cover this line man as well uh, this is the plus strength line man that's good to know So we'll see how this goes. Worst case. Um, yep. Damn. He's got a really nice hat. What kind of hat? It's a hat of the alchemist. Resist electricity, fire, cold, and magic. Hmm. It's real good. It means nothing to no one. No, I understand what it means. I get it. Let's see, if you dodge backwards, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is the fourth game, Magnetic North. Uh, we're um, one oh and two. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Uh, I do have a reroll, that helps. How far can I run? I can run all the way over here, put a pass. That's a three plus pass, see? Three plus passes over here now. Much better. Um, hmm. Do I want to do a one die? Um, maybe I do. Hmm. Is there a better option? Um, this is a loner, so he can't move. What are you? Well, you're surf bait, I guess. Yeah, you're surf bait, but we can we can deal. Nope. F well, okay. I guess that sorted that out then. Um. Oh, he's got guard. Well, that was stupid then. I should have double checked and I didn't. Uh. Oh, nice. Yes. Let me follow up. Now run this way. Okay. Punch that goal. Yeah. Okay, so that's a pass, and we're running out of time, but that's hopefully fine. Uh, because we have a reroll. Use it or lose it. Let's see what he thinks is more important to have his mummy up or not. Not! Okay, so my uh, Robo Robocop is holding on to it. Once again, he can get a uh, he can get a one die block on it um, if he wants to with a blodge goal. Uh, 
so that's a six plus to not get out of my hands. He's done it before, he exclaimed bitterly. Mm. But more importantly, Robo McGroff, the crime dog bot, managed to get uh, an accurate pass. Okay. That's how slightly annoyed I am. Okay. What? No. What? what did I click? What's going on? <sighs> oh god, why is there a clock? Don't you? Oh, well, that was... Okay, so <laughs> the zombie fell down and badly hurt himself. Which uh, definitely helps out. Uh, Stupid zombies. Yeah, um, I know, right? And we still have a reroll, which is nice. So hopefully... We can do this. Yay! Sherbert of Nothing Ram! He did it! Finally. <sighs> yeah? Did he? Mm hmm. He did. That's such a good name. Whew. Well, I'm relieved. Uh, in that, uh... <laughs> well, yeah, you just took a bathroom break. Oh, God, I clicked on this link and it was loud. Can't believe that and, happened. Uh, so, we, uh, we did the best we could. We're 1-1 in -one halftime, and, uh, it's my, uh, I'm receiving. So, we can hopefully do the same thing again. But in reverse. Because you're going up I the died. other side of the pitch. The elves got me. Lucky. Elves will do that. What game are you playing again? Dungeon Crawl. What's that about? You gotta go to rooms. There's lots, lots of different rooms. Yeah, let me link you. I can't believe you're going into rooms. You of all people. What if there's a bed in that room? Gonna go and have it sleep in it. Okay, are you a goon? A goon? Yes. Yeah. I'm pretty sure everyone is. Well, most people in the Skype call. I'm not. What? What? Are you serious? You're not a goon? Well, Munin bought me an account, but I'm not. <laughs> Wow. Well, then you are, like, not not technically. No, well, no. That's technically, yeah, that's the definition. Pretty sure, technically, you're a goon. I guess. Maybe well, not in intent. Yes, it wasn't planned. You're a non-consensual goon. Okay, we're basically going to do the same thing again. Um, he he moved the mummies out to the side, which is good in a way, because it means it's going to be... Um, <clears throat> they're not going to get into play until a bit... Like, uh, until turn two. More rerolls. Uh, good. <coughs> Deep kick, also good. Uh... Blitzer, get rid of the zombie. Thank you. Okay, so now we have a clear path. That should be semi-clear even if I don't knock this gold down, which I did, so that was nice. 
but didn't hmm. and you go over there sheriff nothing ram oh nice because if, if, you, if you can get an extra um, okay let's see if the thrower wants to pick it up he did so that's really nice let's see how how close can you get oh see I can go I can go at least one step forward that's nice Microchip. Oh. And I'm putting this blitzer here just to stop any movement this way. And now we'll see what happens. I'm going to try and do a, a, a quick touchdown because, well, in the first half, I had pretty good success with obstructing the uh, undead's cage. So, I think it's, it uh, so I think it's safer for me to to just uh, try and score quickly and then uh, okay, so this guy's still free. We might actually do a long pass here. Yeah. Okay, this might... What? Ah. What the... I do not know why he moved like that. Because if he wanted to push me here, he could have gone over here instead, which would have had the same result. Okay, so uh, we can't score this turn because, well, all my dudes are tied up. So instead, uh, we're just going to move our guys about some more. a misclick, shouldn't have clicked like that. But okay. And I'm still mo leaving this blitzer down here uh, and this lineman because I need someone that can, if I have to do a handoff pass, I have someone with that loner here that can put a move on stuff. Okay, Sheriff of the Northern Ram, let's see what you can do. Be the elf we expect you to be. Be all that you can be in the elfy reserve. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll <laughs> use a reroll and then fail it, but that's okay. <laughs> I still have, I'm in a, I'm actually, I feel like I'm in an even better position now. I've got four players up here. Uh, let's see. They're all, well, three of them are in scoring position. <clears throat> and one of them is basically in blitz position. Um, 
so I'm, I'm, I want I want to spread uh, the undead out as much as possible um, because I feel like I'm stronger then if they're uh, spread out like these zombies here on the front line they're just gonna stick here they can't really go anywhere else and that's gonna be a push See if we can. Uh, no, I still want to. Well, damn it. Oh, well, it's crap. Oh well. Like he hasn't threatened my ball carrier yet, so I'm still fine with this. In, like in a sense, like it's not. Uh, it's not the end of the world. Um. I mean, it is. Well, that sucked. Because I'm slowly but surely running out of players. But I'm holding on to. Oh, stop stunning them! Crying out loud! They have armor value eight, after all. Mm -hmm. They're super durable. We'll see here what happens. Uh, ah, damn it! I'd hope they wouldn't. F <laughs> <laughs> oh dear! This is. Uh, uh, oh well, he d he didn't get stunned. There you go. Uh, what league is this in? Are you in Mr. Hardwick Invitational, the best league in Blood Bowl Chaos Edition? Is that the official motto of the league? No, it just is. What is the official motto of the league? Uh, don't know, you'll have to ask Empillion about that. Okay, so this is what problematic is because now I'm apparently down to seven players. And more importantly, I don't have enough of them around um, here, actually. No, I'm still fine. Um, hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, you need to be up here. Yes, don't fucking do that to me now. That's a terrible motto. Okay, so we have three players here. That should be fine. All of his fast moving players are in the backfield because they're not uh, they're not threatening my ball carrier. They can base him if they want. Uh, but that's gonna need two GFI.
Okay. Mm -hmm. Is that some kind of alarm grunting? Huh? That weird do 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 noise in the background. Picking up a weird noise? I assume it's you, because it's generally you. Um, hmm. Hmm. Actually. Uh, that's probably that's probably better than my other options because I I I am still playing to win. So uh, let's try and do that. Nope, that's not how I want... Ooh, is this a better run? No, it's not. Okay, let's see here. I'm... That's a 3+. plus. Um, I'm, I'm passing here, even though it's a bit risky, just because uh, these guys can't pick the ball up. And... I am also elf and have safe throw. Okay, eight seconds left. <laughs> okay. So, uh, for those keeping track at home, that was a 3+, plus, 2+, plus, 2+, plus, 2+. Plus. No! No, it wasn't. It was a 3+, plus, 3+, plus, 2+, plus, 2+, plus, 2+. Plus. With the reroll, without using it. Just, so, probably succeeds about 95% of the time. Well, mm, no, but, like... As an elf. Um, it's more that the more you... Um, hmm, what am I trying to say? I'm trying to say that uh, the further you get, the easier it is to succeed with it. But, I mean, once... That's why accurate, I feel, is so important on, uh, on elf throwers. If you want to have a passing game with an elf team, you need accurate. Because accurate means you get a 3+. plus on well you saw yourself I can pass up like seven or eight squares on a three plus and you already have a reroll uh, so it's pretty likely to succeed whereas if you don't have accurate it's a three plus but shorter range and in that case in those instances I'm more like well I can probably just run up and get a do a GFI and get something better Oh. Mm. Perfect defense. Um. Let's do that. Mostly so we can get closer to the ball. With the splitzer here. Ooh. No rerolls used. 
they still have a decent shot at um, at getting a touchdown. It's going to be a question of how quickly they can mold, move the ball down. Um, I am getting low on, well, players. So it's harder for me to uh, just be a nuisance um, and position myself in ways where I can be. Hmm. Okay. Did not expect him to go for Robo Inspector Gadget. Maybe he hates the name. Could be. You can't hate it that much because he's getting a lot of both downs and choosing pushes instead. So, I mean, if he really hated the name, he would have gone for the both down, I'm sure. I think he's down trying to draw. I think. Yeah. Not a fun hammer. Oh, sure, but I'm nothing Ram still hasn't. He needs that elusive second touchdown. But he's not getting it. Okay, so the ghoul grabbed it. Now, I am not sure why he... Uh, hang on, let's double check Wait, and see what the just... SPP is. No, there's no reason to do a vanity pass here. Um, but he did, so. Maybe he just wanted on that goal, so he wanted it on the other side. Because yeah. he's got zombies up there. Yeah. Mm. No, he could probably run. Okay, uh, let's see. This thrower can make it over there if this, if this zombie gets out of the way. Put that. Yeah, we're going to have to do it this way if we want to try and threaten the ball, which I still do. Ah, uh, that's a shame. We didn't we didn't knock him down. Uh, this is the, uh, that's the blodge one. Oh, hang on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Okay, so let's see if we can do this. Uh, let's start by going over here. Okay, so my, my plan... Is as simple as it is simple. Just uh, burning Tom in the chat. Yeah, no. Uh, if I can move this zombie down here, I can then move this line man as well. And then I can use uh, the line man to blitz the ghoul. Because the ghoul has. Uh, the ghoul has blodge. And I'll be honest, I. Oh, well, that's not... Hmm. Well, it's still going to be a one die block, so the question is... Okay, let's do the safe things first. Get rid of you. Oh, oh fuck it. Let's do it. Are you going to run out of time just as you get there? No. Well, yes. Okay. Um, I mean, not good enough because we didn't knock the ball loose, but we did get our blitz on the ball carrier and we uh, tied up some pit players. Now, he can still blitz himself free. He can dodge himself free. Uh, but these are the players he can has to deal with, so at least we made it a bit more annoying. OK. 
Okay, so this seems like he's just gonna dodge away from me. Yeah, I thought he would blitz with the ghoul and push the yeah, throw back. Yeah, uh, same. Nope. What? What? Okay. Oh, the odd switcheroo. Now, it, granted, he does have a lot of rerolls, but... I... Like, he needs to run so far with this guy to be safe, and I still have my Blitzer here. That he can't do anything with. Counting on the dub skulls. Like, it, it probably would have been safer just, if you're gonna dodge, dodge down this way, I think. Uh, okay. Uh, let's get that ball back, shall we? Uh, I'd probably put the throw in scoring position first. Yeah, you well, we could, I guess. Um, he's in scoring position, one, two, three. Over here. Maybe you can stand up that guy on the sideline. No, I'm, I'm... I'm waiting because I'm gonna push him. I'm gonna push... The white and the ball's gonna bounce. So, I wanna have as many... Players as possible around. Um, That's true. Oh. That is... Interesting position. Yeah, luckily the ghouls are kind of out of position. So, I'm hoping... Phew. Oh, this is a loner. Okay, let's see if we can do it. Uh, hmm. This is... Yes, I'm gonna... I'm gonna try the loner here because I... Otherwise... Ah, uh, nope. <laughs> uh, did... Okay, so he rolled a one, and then he rolled a one on the loner, and then he KO'd himself. So let's have a look at the... The ghouls can't reach. The white can't reach. Uh, <laughs> my players can't reach. But yeah, that was... Um, well, he was standing here, so I couldn't really block him in a... I may have been able to block him in a way where I could have... Oh, no, what happened to him? Uh, ah, fucking... Why am I getting so many miss next? That's annoying. But he did use his reroll, so he's probably not going to GFI here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is this zombie going to go down and try and pick it up? He might. That is annoying. Um, I have no idea how you're going to get out of this one. I have some options because he stacked this. But it's going to mean giving up. Uh, the question is how do I do a touchdown? And that's difficult because it's going to go through so many... No, actually, I don't on. think you need a touchdown. You just need to try and punt it. Well, I always need a touchdown. Well, actually, it's 2-1, so no, yeah. I don't need a touchdown. Um, if I push this guy, he's going to end up back here, which I don't want. Um, yes, I'm going to have to do a GFI and then blitz out. To do it. I forgot I was in the lead for a, sh a short second. Uh. 
perfect. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Just as planned. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with this team. I guess it's because of that game I played on Friday where I rolled too good. Uh, with my... With my humans. <sighs> Who got the MVP? Robo Time Cop got the MVP. That's good. Hmm. Oh, we have a bunch of money. Um, this is looking like Strippen's team. Yeah, but he's got he's even better because he's Wood Elf, so he definitely doesn't need them, linemen. Uh, congrats, Robo Time Cop. You get kick. Uh, hmm. I get it because it's just John Claude from down. Exactly. Very good. Very good. Hmm. Okay, we have a bunch of money. Uh, we should buy two new linemen, and regardless of what happens after that, we're going to start buying uh, catchers. That's the plan. Here we go. So, that means we need to have a look at the um, look at the list of good names. Magnum IP. Right. I'm not sure what that noise was, IV. I didn't. Mm. I, I looked around the room and didn't see it. So. You it's looked for noise. Maybe yeah. that's why you didn't see it because it's a noise. Oh. oh. Fuck. Yeah. I guess you're right. Uh, and then. Agaton bot. Hmm. <laughs> Robo Commissioner Gordon. Commissioner Bot Gordon. No, I like Robo Commissioner Gordon. Yeah, I could have I could have bought a catcher. Uh and a line man, that's true. But I st still don't want to buy catchers. Because I want, um, I want more SPP on my line man, and I want SPP on my other blitzer. Just like the real Wigum, he doesn't do anything. Yep. <laughs> Uh, save. 